Hi, I'm Keegan with Econ Tutoring Center, and I'm uh, going to be talking a little bit about distributing uh, through parentheses, which we call it kind of foiling. Um, and uh, in any case, let's get started. So, uh, foiling, foil stands for first, outside, inside, last. Um, and so, to understand what that means, uh, let's start off with the general form. Let's say we have a x plus b times uh, c x plus d. Okay, we have you know two things that we're multiplying together. We're going to try and end up with a with kind of a simplified form that no longer has any parentheses and. Uh, we can see that there is a first term for each of these two uh, these two factors. Okay, so there's uh, this cx and this ax would be the first term. Then there's an outside, which is kind of the two things that are on the outside, which is d and ax. Inside, so that would be b and cx, and last. So the last thing in each of the uh, of the factors is uh, b and then d. Okay. So um, so if we multiply this out, uh, we have that this equals, and we first multiply the first terms. So we get ax times cx outside. So we so we. We're going to be uh, multiplying each of these things together and adding them. Uh, so outside, we would do ax times d so plus ax times d. Inside, so plus b times cx. And last, so plus b times d. Okay, and so uh, if we simplify that, we would get ac x squared uh, plus a d x plus b c x plus b d. Um, so let's go ahead and do an actual uh, example with numbers. Um, so. If we want to find out what this is equal to, we start off by multiplying the first terms. So 3x times 2x, which is 6x uh, squared. And then outside, 3x times negative 3. So, at, so 6x squared plus 9x, that's 3x times 3, except it's a negative, so we're going to go ahead and switch this to a negative, minus 9x, then the inside, plus 5 times 2x, so plus 10x, 5 times 2x, and we finally do the last, which is uh, plus 5 times negative 3, which is negative 15, so minus 15. And then, of course, we can combine uh, these middle two terms. We have 6x squared uh, plus 1x, so plus x, minus 15. Okay? Um, and then, obviously, you could do all sorts of different variations on what these are. This could be a negative 2 uh, or any other number. Um, but this is how it proceeds, um, and so hopefully that should help you guys out. Uh, if not, or if you have any other questions, go ahead and leave a comment on the video, or come into the tutoring center, or ask your professor.